Welcome to Imperial CAD system. In this video, I will explain the usage of commands counter flange and a three bend corner in a UGNX. So first I explain counter flange, I go to sketch, I select plane, go for OK. For counter flange, you can either select edge or you can either select open profile, not closed profile, open profile. So I create profile like this. Just 90 degrees. I took a profile. Then So, if you select counter flange for an open profile, see we need to select base here, then a sheet is added, see like this, with some thickness, see here we can give width of the sheet, symmetry or uh, one side, I, I give 100 mm. And here you can change its thickness. See, go for use local value and change. Either up, above or below, you can give, you can change the direction. I change it to 3 mm thickness. Bend parameters also you can change. See, bend parameters right now it is 3 mm. Now I change this to some 5 then i go for okay so for counter flange you can select a line profile or an open profile see here you can see secondary option base and secondary in counter flange then what is the secondary see you can select edge in secondary you, you have to select edge See, for base you need to select profile. Here it just keeps single profile. So that single edge will be getting selected. See here, you can see a plane. Then I want a plane at the start. See, now you need to create a profile. Then whatever the profile you take the shape, then you will get a sheet according to that profile. So like this also you can use counter flange. See not chain here you need select finite. See if you select finite you can give width under that. Symmetric both sides it's that sheet. To end up to end you will get a sheet. You can change a bend radius here. Like this, you can also use a count. You can also apply counter flange directly onto the edge. I again edit that. See here, another option is the chain. So you just select adjacent edge. Oh, both the edges got selected. Only single edge, single curve you need to keep. I cancel this. I again edit roll back. Single curve I select. Then here I keep chain option, select that edge. Once again I select, edit roll back here. Okay, let it be that chain. After selecting chain option, then you just select here single curve. Then select the edge. See, adjacent edge to that also we get a sheet. This side also I select like this you can create you can use a counter flange for such kind of outputs see this is a usage of a counter flange i delete then what is this three bench corner in agnx i also explained this option in this video for that i use flange and i select the edge 
some value i give 40 and here the bin should be outside bend outside adjacent to that edge i also go to not three bend corner i go to flange again and here also i generate the same type of sheet with any length let it be 40 then i go for okay so the sheets are intersected together so this won't happen see the sheet will not go inside into the other sheet so i select this three bend corner and i selected both the bends then you can see it's finishing see like this it trims and we get a single edge like this so we can use a three bend corner option here you can see open that also we can close by going into edit option here you can see closed see then that will be closed circular cut out there are different options in that see to give some uh, values to that gap diameter circular cut up circular cut out i give diameter 5 so you can see 5 mm gap u cut out and just u cut out also you we see diameter as well as offset see offset i change you can see the changes in that like a open profile see we cut out here we get the angle on both sides so we can give different angles so i guess some 30 degrees like that so always it should be some uh, uh, open or closed then go for okay like this we need to use three bend corner in ug nx so thank you for watching this video for more videos share and subscribe imperial cat system